amid continuing worry over the fate of Joshimat town which is facing the threat of sinking due to land subsidence Uttarakhand chief minister provided an update regarding the situation Sabko milzul kar Joshimat ko bachane ka samay hai Sab log ek team ke roop mein kaam kare sabhi log milkar sarkar hai samajik sangathan hai rajnitik sangathan hai hamari sabki pehli prathmikta hai ki Joshimat shehar basna chahiye aur logon ki jaan maal ki suraksha hone chahiye sab log ab istan par lag gaye hain और जो खतरे की जद में आने वाले अड़सठ मकान थे उन सभी को शिफ्ट किया गया है और जो एक जोन बना है 600 मकानों से अधिक का उनको भी वहाँ से सुरक्षित स्थानों पर ले जाने की कार्रवाई गतिमान है और माननीय प्रधानमंत्री जी भी लगातार इसकी समीक्षा कर रहे हैं लगातार व्यक्तिगत रूप से जानकारी ले रहे हैं Amid outrage over the handling of the urination incident on an Air India flight, two allegedly drunk passengers on an Indigo flight were arrested on 8th January. The passengers allegedly tried to consume liquor on the Delhi to Patna flight even though it is prohibited on domestic flights. Patna police made the arrests with the help of the CISF. There was no disruption on board and the passengers stopped when asked by a crew member according to sources quoted by NDTV. Manpreet Monica Singh has become the United States first female Sikh judge. She was sworn in as a Harris County judge on January 6. Born and raised in Houston, Manpreet now lives in Bel Air with her husband and two children. Her father immigrated to America in the early 1970s. A trial lawyer for 20 years, Manpreet has been involved in numerous civil rights organizations. Houston's first South Asian judge Ravi Sandal who presided Manpreet swearing in ceremony said it was a big moment for the Sikh community to have an ambassador for all women of color with philippines inflation skyrocketing to a 14 year high and in prices in the southeast asian country have reached a whopping rupees 1000 per kg in fact the country's government is investigating a potential price manipulation in onions The Philippines Agriculture Department is planning to import 22,000 tons of onions to boost domestic supply amid the surging price of the vegetable, possibly making it the most expensive in the world. Onion is a key ingredient in Filipino cuisine, with most households using it along with garlic. The price spike has hit consumers particularly hard during the year and holidays, with food taking center stage in many gatherings, prompting more than a few to air their rants on social media.